Plants are sentient, they're living things. How can vegetarians or vegans have a problem with eating animals when plants also feel pain? On what basis are you right now comparing a plant to an animal? Is cutting a potato equal to chopping your head off? Because if you're now comparing based on life, a plant's alive, so is the pig, so is every human being. How come you guys are special, but the pig's not? Oh, no, 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 you can't kill me because blah, 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 whatever. Do you really feel that cutting of an animal is the same of cutting of a plant? Do you know what a stamen or a pistil is? They're the reproductive organs for plant. If I right now went and plugged into a flower and plucked out the stamen and the pistil, and then I were to say, take a child and chop their privates off, is genital mutilation and that the same? No. Then you have your answer. Clearly, you understand when this happens, there is no pain and suffering involved, and it's not the same. But when it happens to an animal or a human, it's different. But then, I'm a human, I am not an animal. No, you are definitely an animal. You belong to the kingdom Animalia, phylum Chordata. You're of the order mammal. You're of the class primate, or then I think family hominid, genus, homo, and species sapiens. We are homo sapiens under the animal kingdom, and we're comparing the homo sapiens species to non human animal species, which makes complete logical sense. Why on earth are they bringing a plant in there from the plant kingdom? And really, if it was the same, then I'm telling me if someone right now nuked the city and killed thousands of people and I brushed my teeth, that's the same. I'm killing far more bacteria by brushing my teeth, by the way. Very poor argument. But people love to hide behind it again because there is no consequence for it, so...